to Ms. Infant Kid. Today I'm going to do a review on the Presto Flipside Waffle Maker. And I think this waffle maker is great, and I'll show you why. So the way I do it is just pour the batter in, and this is about three quarters of a cup, and scoop the rest that's out with a spoon. Then we're just gonna put it on the cutting board. Gonna close the waffle iron. Set the timer at once to turn it to the zeros and how many times that you, the minutes you want. You can't do half minutes. And then I just flip the waffle iron. And I flipped it for the last minute. So it beeps when it's done. And it's really easy to get the waffle out. And we just put it in the oven so it doesn't get soft. So I'm doing now the top tips for this waffle iron. And the first one is to use a spoon to scoop the excess batter out. And for whatever you're putting the batter in to put in the waffle iron, I suggest putting that on a cutting board after because that makes it much easier and much not messier. So I suggest also putting your timer to three and I think, I think that's the perfect time for a waffle. And that is sort of when putting in the waffles. Now, um, or after this wa when this waffle is coming out, I'll do tips on taking out the waffle. So now tips for getting out the waffle. First, we just want to use a fork to lift it up and use some tongs to get it out. And sometimes a pot holder helps for getting it out. And we're just going to open the oven. And as you can see, there's lots of waffles in there. And this is set to 200 Fahrenheit. And this just keeps the waffles from getting moist. So now for reasons why I think this waffle iron is great. So I think this waffle iron is great because the waffles come out really easily. They don't get stuck. And after you make them, there's not much to clean. So that's really good about it. Also, you can freeze the waffles. So during the week, you can just have them and not have to make them. Um, another thing is that it has a timer. So you know when they're done and you can set the timer. But as I mentioned, you can't do like half minutes, so that's one of the annoying things. Um, also, it's on um, the flip side, so you flip it when um, you're making the waffles. And you can lock it up right. So that's really good. And yeah, those are the reasons why I think this waffle iron is great. So now lastly, I'm going to show you how to lock the waffle iron upright. So there are these two red tabs on both sides. So you're just going to bring the waffle iron up and pull the red tabs up until it holds. And the same thing, pulling the red tabs down when you want to unlock it. And that is how you unlock and lock the lock. All in all, I think this waffle iron is really great. And I hope you enjoy the video.